guys, it's Vlogtober day 14. Um, I haven't uploaded 11 and 12 yet, but it is a combined video for those two days. And I didn't record anything yesterday on the 13th. Um, I had work all day and then I had to go pick up the kids from their dads. So I didn't get home until like eight o'clock or so. Um, day 14, just a quick check-in. Um, I'm real quick making a smoothie, like a green, what is it called, a green smoothie, um, before I go out and go hunting with Josh. Um, dropping the kids off at my mom's and she's going to do homework and I'm going to pick up a pizza or something for them. So they'll be having that while we are out back in her woods to do a little hunting, see if we can find anything tonight. So wish us luck. I'll do a quick little video of what is in tonight's smoothie. So in the smoothie tonight, I'm going to have some chopped spinach, some triple berry blend with blueberries, strawberries, and raspberries. Some super seeds blend of chia flax and hemp. And then I'm also going to add a big scoop of protein powder. Yay! It's got MCT oil and all that stuff. And then, of course, a big old two cups of water. Real quick note about this protein powder. Um, if any of you guys have tried protein powder in the past and didn't like it because it had that really gross protein powder after flavor, um, I recommend this one. This It's Slim Quick. They repackaged it. It used to be... It never used to say keto on it, but of course, now that that's the cool thing, that's what it says now, but it's my favorite protein powder. Um, it's got fairly low carbs. It's got all sorts of high amounts of protein, and it has like, what is it, less than 1% of sugar, one gram of sugar. So that's one of the lowest sugar contents you're going to find in a lot of the protein powders out there. This is definitely my favorite one, and the flavor is amazing. I love it in my shakes. I love it for just a plain protein shake, and I love it um, in my baked goods and stuff too. It's absolutely fantastic. And I almost forgot, um, one last thing I add is a little bit of liquid stevia, just to make it a little bit sweeter to take away some of the bitterness of that spinach. 